good morning once again <laughs> technical difficulties um yes, yes. i don't know what happened we do apologize for that but we're going on uh, my name is jamel and i'm lakeisha we want to welcome you to progressively becoming morning devotions yes. Yes. um god is so good this morning oh yeah he is absolutely amazing wherever you are can you just open up your mouth and begin to speak well about god He's, yes, amazing. he's amazing. He's awesome, he's awesome and yes. holy in all of his ways. Yes. There is nobody like him. Yes. We can search all over and we can find nobody that compares to our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Psalm 63 is clear. Early will I seek thee, my soul first after thee. Yes, yes, yes. To see thy presence, to see thy glory, to be with God. God to be in his presence because that love and kindness has been better than life can anybody agree that God's goodness has been better than anything we have ever experienced today we just want to approach the throne of grace with you oh yes goodness goodness God's goodness is all around us this morning yeah. God thank you thank for you, another day thank, you, thank you for life thank you for help thank you for strength God thank we you, Jesus, are alive God. because there is more yes God thank you Lord for all that you've done thank, thank you God. Lord for all that you are going to do God, we are but here. even if you do nothing else God we thank you, thank you God. just for being God Absolutely. thank you thank you thank you, thank you God. your goodness and and your mercy and your favor. Yes, we love you today, God. When I think of the Thank goodness Jesus. of Jesus hallelujah. and all that he's done for me, God, I just got a hallelujah thank in you, my Jesus, spirit. God. Thank you, God. God thank you, here. God, for thank saving you, me. Thank you, thank you, thank have you. Way, oh, have your way thank in you, this Jesus, place, God. in this thank space, you, God. God. Move yes, by God. your power. Thank you, Move Jesus, by God. your spirit. Spirit, Lord, thank you, God. thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jesus, Oh, God. glory to your name, thank God. You, God. Thank you, Um, This scripture has been in my spirit for That's the good. last few weeks. Um, Psalm 46 and 1. Yeah. God is our refuge mm -hmm. and our strength. Yes, he is. He is a very present help you, in the time of trouble. Thank you, God. And I just want to leave a little bit of encouragement for you this morning. Yeah. And just let you know that in all things that we go through, I just want to let you know that God is our protector yeah. and our keeper. No matter what is happening around us, he is our safe place. He is the God that is today and always. You may be a place in a place now where you feel alone, you may be down, you may not be sure which way to turn, things not, may not be going just quite right. You may feel like you're going through, um, you know, despair, you may be yeah. going through sickness, you may be going through a loss, you, or you may just feel like all hope is lost. But I want you to know today that our God yes, is with you. Yes, he yes. will never leave you nor forsake you. People may forsake you, but God, he will not fail us. Never, never will he fail us. You may get bogged down on what's going on around us. Life isn't always easy. Even things that are not directly happening to us when you see so much going on in the world today so much sickness so much disease so much calamity mm -hmm. it still has an effect on it all does. of us really some does. of you may have the weight of the world on your shoulders but I just want you to know to just lean on God <laughs> he can take it he can take he it. can handle it he give it all that. to him yes, lean on him depend on him yes, he will never leave you nor forsake you he will walk with you he will talk with you. Yes, he will be all that you need him to be when you yeah. need him to be it. God is with us in all things so that we do. Yes, no matter where he is, where we are, he is there. So as the Bible says in Joshua 1 and 9, be strong, strong and, courageous. and courageous. Do not be afraid Thank or you, discouraged. Thank you, for God. the Lord your God is with you wherever you yeah. go. I love that yes. scripture. Scripture. He is the I am. Mm. What that means is that he's whatever you need him to be. Yes. He's wherever you need him to be. God will show.
show up you, for God. you. Call on the name of Jesus and Thank he Jesus. will be there. We look to ourselves and even others to be our refuge. We look to others to be our strength. Yes. But who do you think we get that strength from? Yes. We get our strength from the most high God. When you are at your lowest and somehow, mm -hmm. some way you make it out, you make it through, <laughs> you make it over that hump. It wasn't on our own strength. It Thank wasn't you, on Jesus. our own power, it but it was the power of God. Thank you, God. He gives us the power, y'all, to keep moving. Thank you, God. He gives us the power to keep pushing through. Thank he you, gives us the strength to just keep one foot in front of the other. Thank you, God. It's all God. It's you, all Jesus. him. He is our help in all things. And as the scripture says, he is our help in Jesus. the time of trouble. You, God. God exists in the present moment always. Yes, Whatever Lord. God is, he is right now. Thank you, Jesus. Stop and realize that at this moment, he is with you. God you, is God. our strength. God is our joy. Yes, God. God is our peace. God is our comfort. God is our way maker. God is our strong tower. God is all that you need yes, him yes. to be when you need him to be it. Call on the name Jesus. of Jesus because he is with you. Thank you, God. Thank you. God is Thank with you. us. He is yes. Hallelujah. our refuge Thank you, and our help in Thank the time you, of trouble. Thank so listen, you. we're just going to pray. Father, Thank in Jesus' name. Jesus. We thank you for your love and your compassion and your mercy towards us. Thank you, O oh Lord, that we are able to experience a brand new day. Yes. This is the day that the Lord has made and we shall rejoice in it and be glad. God, there are many things that we can complain about. There are many things that may not be happening well in our lives. Oh, yes. But what is true is that you have never left us and you will never forsake us. So God, even in times of difficulty, we can do what the scripture says. Come boldly unto your throne of grace to obtain mercy and to find grace to help in the time of need. Father, we are in a time of need. Our nation is in calamity. Our world is in calamity. Our, our world is in confusion. But God, you are our refuge and our strong tower. So now, Father, we approach your throne of grace with all confidence that now unto him that is able to do exceedingly and abundantly above all that we can even ask or think. We approach your throne with the confidence that greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. We approach your throne with confidence that you are able to perform and accomplish everything that you have purposed us to do. And God, on this morning, we acknowledge your goodness. We acknowledge your presence. We acknowledge your favor over our lives and we declare if it had not been for you who was on our side where would we be so father you are the great I am yes you are you are Jehovah you are a covenant keeping father you are the God that was which is and which is to come you are the great I am you are the will in the middle of the will you are the bright and morning star you are the rose of Sharon you are the king soon and coming king and we exalt your name in this place. God, wherever we are, I ask that even now in your presence, your presence go with us. Your presence meet us in our homes. Your presence meet us in our jobs. Your presence meet us in our cars. And God, we declare today, we shall see your help. Thank you, Jesus. We shall see your help. We shall see you show up. Show up in ways, in ways, in ways that we prayed for you to show up. God, you are working it out on our good. You're working it for our good. Even on our jobs, you're making ways out of no ways. Even in our families, when it comes to our children, you are making ways out of no ways. So, Father, we say, have your way. Yes, God. Have your way, Holy Ghost. Yes, do what it is that you can do. But heal, set free, and deliver. Yes, Lord, deliver us from trouble. Yes, God, set us free from the captivity that's over our minds and over our spirits. Yes, Lord, today, today is a day of 
freedom. Today is a day that we declare that who the Son has set free is free indeed. So God, this morning, we walk in your freedom. Yes, Lord, open up your mouth and declare his freedom. Yes, Lord, our homes are being freed. Yes, God, our minds are being free. Yes, God, our spirits are being free. Our emotions are being free. Yes, Lord, free us. Free us so we can be free to worship. And God, we are blessed. We bless your holy name. We magnify you. God, we thank you. We thank you that we can approach your throne. We can approach your throne because we are. We are the child. We are the children of the most high God. So now, God, even in our homes, we settle. We settle that you are good. Even in our homes right now, God, we settle that you are good. And we shall see your goodness. The scripture says that we shall see your goodness in the land of the living. Wait upon the Lord and be of good courage. And God, we know that you are going to strengthen our hearts. That's it. That's it. God, you make all things well. That's it, God. Things are turning around. That's it, oh God. Things are turning around. Things are looking better, saints. I said things are looking better. Things are looking better. God, give us the wisdom to proceed. Give us the knowledge on how to move forward. God, give us the grace on what to say. God, give us the knowledge, the wisdom, the understanding to do all things well. And God, we put our hands in the hands of the master. Yes, God, only you can take care of us. Yes, God, forgive us for putting our faith and confidence in other people. But today, we put our faith and we put our confidence in you. And we declare that we are free. Yes, God, we are free. Praise the Lord. I'm free. No longer bound and no longer chained. But praise the Lord. I am free. Thank you, Holy Ghost, that you're making us free. Thank you, Holy Ghost, that you are making us whole. Even in our bodies, God, you are healing us. Even in our bodies, you are healing us, healing us from the pains of our past. You're healing us from guilt. You're healing us from regret. You are healing us, oh God. Heal our minds. Heal our spirits. Heal our souls. Heal our bodies. Yes, Lord, we still believe that there's a bomb in Gilead for the healing of our souls. We still believe that you are able, you are able to do that what the doctor says is impossible. We believe that you are able to do that what the doctor says cannot be done. God, somebody has appointments that they have to attend, but we declare your healing. Somebody has to go to the doctor, but we declare your healing. Before we get out of our homes, we declare your healing. God, every high place be brought down. Every high place, we bring it down in Jesus' name. Every crooked road, we declare it straight. Every dark path be illuminated by your word. And we say, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, you are welcome. You are welcome in our lives. So now, God, we declare, we declare your goodness. That's it, saints. Open up your mouth and begin to declare his goodness. Come on, it may not look like it, but he is good. Open up your mouth and declare his refuge. I declare today that you will see the salvation of the Lord. I declare today that you shall see him. You shall see his healing power. You shall see his freedom. And today, will be like a day that you have never experienced before because we say Holy Ghost have your way that's it have your way you go before us you go before us you clear the path yes God clear us from distractions the distractions that keep us from moving forward clear us of God from the noise from all of the noise that surround us yes God free us free us so we can lift our hands without hesitation without trouble and without fear free us so our spirits can worship free us so our minds can worship free us so our souls can worship let everything that have breath 
praise the Lord. I said, let everything, let everything, let everything, let everything that have breath praise the Lord. So we declare, we declare our children are safe. We declare our families are protected. We declare our bodies are healed. And we declare, as the scripture has said this morning, you are our refuge. Yes, he's saving us. That's it. Call upon the name of Jesus. Let the wicked forsake his ways and the ungodly man his thoughts and let him return to him. Return, return, return unto us, God. Yes, God, we may have fell off, but today we come running back to you. Yes, God, we may have dipped in our prayer life, oh, but this morning we come running back to you. Thank you, Jesus, that as you draw near to you, oh God, you would draw near to us and we declare favor over this day. I declare to you that God is working it out for you. Come on, would you put that in the chat? Say, God is working it out for me. I don't know how. I don't know where he's going to make the way. I don't see the resources. I don't see the provision. I don't know how the way is going to be made. I'm losing my mind. I don't know what to do. Ah, but the word says peace that I give unto you. Not that the world gives but Jesus gives us peace. Ah, peace, peace, peace. I speak to you today. Peace. Oh, peace that guards our heart and our minds in Christ Jesus. And I declare God's going to give you peace. He's going to give you rest. Stop worrying. Yes, you stop worrying. Stop worrying. Take rest in his abilities to do exceedingly and abundantly above all that we can even act. So think I came to declare to you today as Lakeisha has said this morning that God is about to show up in your lives and you're about to get some help yeah he's going to rescue you he is your refuge in the time of trouble things are happening around us but we declare that you are our refuge come on come on open up your mouth open up your mouth that's it open up your mouth and declare you are my refuge that's it you have a power to save me you have the power to bring me out and god we declare your goodness we declare your goodness we declare your goodness. May God's favor be with you today. I declare his spirit walk with you. I declare his spirit talk to you today in even uncommon ways. I declare God's going to get some glory out of your life. He's, he's getting glory out of your circumstances. He's getting glory out of your trouble. Oh, God, God gets the glory. God gets the glory. In God, we declare, you, we declare as we become, Thank you, Lord. as we become who you have claimed us to be, oh, yes, oh, we yes. shall see your goodness in the yes, land of the living. The Not when we're living. dead, no. but I declare even to some mother yes. that's on this live today, even yes. to some mother that's on this live this morning, that's, that, that may be watching us on YouTube, that may be listening to us on the podcast, yes. I declare mother, that your prayers you shall see answered in the time that you live in. I declare every prayer that you prayed. I declare every prayer. I declare I declare that every prayer of rescue that you prayed for your child, you shall see it in the land of the living. Mother, rest, rest, rest in his abilities, rest in his confidence, mother. It's going to work out. It's going to work out. God is able to do. He is able to do exceedingly. God is He's able, he's able, he's able. Oh, yes, hallelujah, mm. Jesus. Hallelujah, Thank Jesus. you, Jesus. Thank you, God. We God, you are able. God, you are able. You are able, God. If we are able, you are able, you are able. If we give your name the praise. We give your name the praise. We give your name the praise. If that's your testimony this morning, would you open up your mouth wherever you are? Open up your mouth wherever you may be and say, God, we give you praise. Yes, he is. He will do. do. Hallelujah. And he's going to fulfill. Thank you, Jesus. Every promise promise to you. It's going to work out, saints. It's it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Hallelujah. Give up on you. Ooh, he's able. He's able. He's able. It's going to work out for you. 
It's going to stop worrying about it. It's going to work out for you. The phone call is coming. The letter in the mail is on its way. It's going to work out for you. All things according to his will. So now, God, I pray. I pray that you, I pray, oh God, that your people experience a freedom in their lives like never before. Thank you, Jesus. I pray that the supernatural power of your grace and mercy now rest upon them. I pray that you will protect them throughout the course of this day. I speak the blessings and favor of God over your life. I speak that every need be met, every need be supplied in accordance to the riches of his greatness, in accordance to his abundance. God has more than enough. To fulfill your need and to even satisfy your wants. God has more than enough. You should not experience lack in your life. Oh, yes. But I pray that God give you wisdom to manage finances yes. and God open up doors of opportunity. You shall see his goodness oh, yes. and you shall see his refuge. Oh, yes. And God, we honor you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for joining us Thank on this you, morning for Thank morning you. devotions every oh, Thursday yes. at 6 a.m. God is good God is and greatly, good. To be praised. greatly to be praised. Yeah, he in the city of our God. Blessed. Hallelujah. Be blessed. Be blessed. Taken with you on today. We love you.